I have a question for um, Mr. Thomas Donovan because you mentioned like the inequitable home situation. So my question is like one of the obvious issues that like is flooding New York City is homelessness. And I feel like it's painfully visible when you walk down any street or they like, get on any train. And as someone who goes to school in the city, I've noticed that some New York, some New York's of poorest and wealthiest neighborhoods are like a train stop away from each other. So my question is, what policies will be formed to provide homes, jobs, healthcare, and mental health services to those who are most vulnerable to the effects of homelessness? And how will you involve socioeconomic equity within all of your policies regarding New York City? That is a big question in 60 seconds, Mr. Donovan. Oh, it's Sean Donovan. Absolutely. So the way we make sure we have equity in every policy is appoint the first ever chief equity officer for New York City that reports directly to the mayor. I would do that. I pledged to do that on the very day I announced to run. And I got to say, Mia, I am so moved by your question. When I was your age growing up in this city, I saw homelessness exploding around me and it made me mad. And I started asking myself, how can it be that we let homeless people sleep on our streets? And that put me to work. I started volunteering in a homeless shelter. You should go do that. I started working for the National Coalition for the Homeless. And guess what? I ended up running the homeless strategy for President Obama. And we made huge progress. And you know how we did that? We did it with something called supportive housing. It's much better than shelter. It's much better than sleeping on the street. It's housing that combines mental health services, substance abuse. It was invented here in New York City and we don't have enough of it. And instead we're sending $3 billion a year on shelters and uh, hotels, but it's not working. We have to, I like to say all the time, we have to reimagine our right to shelter as a right to housing in New York City. I, I learned how to solve this problem across the country. We can do it here if we reimagine our right to shelter as a right to housing.